hello guys welcome to this tutorial in this tutorial we're going to be going over how to make an ebook with pixel app so i already have pixel app so go over to your your um, application and click on pixel app so here now you're going to if you're opening um, pixel app for the first time you see a blank canvas so but this is not the um, size the canvas size is not the canvas size we use for designing ebooks so click on the three dots at the um, right hand corner and click on image size so image size will give us the um, the a field where we can enter the width so the width of normal ebooks is 1600 by 2500 this is in um, in pixels so to one six by 2500 2500 in pixels click on ok so as you can see the canvas has been resized so the next thing is now is to get an image i already downloaded an, an image from the net so click on from gallery Click on from gallery to open your inbuilt um, image gallery. So I already have an image which I got from the net about um, Amazon Echo Dots. I will keep a, a link in the description so that you can go over there and get it. So click on that to open it. So here now we're going to crop the picture. Crop it to one is to one. Click on one is to one crop. Then resize it. Resize it to fit the Amazon Echo Dots Amazon Echo device. So after that, click on OK to make that change. So as you can see, they now we now have um, this picture cropped to our desired size in the screen. So all I have to just do now is just drag it. We are going to make it overlay this whole canvas. So click on that this little circle here and drag. Click on it and drag. Make sure it covers the whole canvas. Let's see. Let's drag again. Drag again. So right now it covers the whole canvas. Let's bring it out a little bit. So once here, all you have to do now is to add text. So click on this A sign at the um, at the bottom. This bottom icon here. This icon. Click on that. Click on plus. This plus icon to add text. So click on this edit to edit it. So remove this new text and put Amazon. Amazon. Then click OK. So as you can see, we now have this text Amazon in our screen. But what we want to, we want to do now is to resize it to make the fonts bigger and then maybe add some font size. So click on font size here and make it a little bit bigger. Once you are, you are satisfied with this change, just click on this um, check mark here. Good. Then to apply that. So we want to like apply custom um, styles. Since we are going to use our own styles, click on this style um, icon here. Then click on browse to open um, different um, styles that you can use so the one i'm using is this one right here sample the one just below this one the last one so as you can see it already has um, pre, um already made uh styles for us so i would like to increase that font size to uh, let's see something yes this one is good so click on ok to accept that change so the next now is to um, get the echo dots logo so i already have it cropped out so i have um the echo dots logo cropped out so from gravity click on um to insert a picture so i will check where i have that echo dots uh my logo is obstructing my logo is obstructing my let's see i don't know if i can see it here if i don't see it here i will actually leave it because the logo up there is obstructing me so i don't think i can reach for it since the logo is obstructing i'll just go back and type it out type it all out so click on new text keep it here and um let's see edit so once we have this right now we have to just type in echo dots so you could dot after click on that to accept that change so we have this right now i have to just go to um the text size increase it a little bit accept that change make it a color of um let's see this um, this one this one click on that this one just go by white i'll go with white 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 okay that's white then um i would like to change the um font so click on fonts here and then let's choose amaranth bold click on ok so we see this is in bold so let's decide that so that it is in alignment with amazon so the next thing now is that um little 
um that little box that is just below so to insert that you are just going to go to this plus sign at the top left hand corner of your screen just click on that plus sign and then you see shapes click on shapes shapes and then it already gives you a um, preset that's a white a rectangle so just resize that with the anchor points click it down resize it so that it fits there yeah. so once we um we are satisfied with this, um this shape click on the good sign there yeah. the checks check mark so the next thing we're going to add a color to this this shape so go to this um circle something like a, a hexagon hexagon icon and then locate color look at the color here click on color icon enable it so we don't need it to be white we need it to be something that tallies with the background so let's just click on this plus sign i click on the plus sign so let me choose a color from the background so choose from here let me choose this one and then click good this check mark there and then once i have this i have to just use click on this okay here to apply that so that's it then you have to just click on um this check mark here this good sign to apply that effect so the next thing is you are going to like lower the opacity of this um this triangle so click on that opacity and reduce it all the way down like this yes this one is good so once you are satisfied with this um change click on good to accept that the next thing we're going to add some text so we're going to click on this a this a um a icon click on text so you see the text here drag it over here so once you have it over here we just click on edit to edit it and write our own custom text so the um, subtitle i'm going to write here is um, amazon echo dot amazon echo dot user guide for all lovers of smart home all lovers of smart home unleash let's see unleash the full full potential of your device okay that should be all so click on ok to accept that change as you can see the text here is too big the text here is too big so what i have to just do is um go to the font the size we want to reduce this font size first is to 32 and then drag it to spread it out then make it enter into this so we want to reduce it further to let's see click on the minus sign here to reduce it gradually gradually so click on okay let's do this one more time click on okay, let's increase it a little so click on the little check mark there to accept that change so the next we're going to justify this so i want to align it let's see align it to the center so that it's it's um in the center so once you click on this center um, alignment you to center it so click on that to accept that change so the next thing we're going to do is just to add a font so i kind of like this amaranth bold so click on amaranth bold to make it amaranth to make it bold then the next thing is put a color of white so that the um text stand out from the background so a color of white will do the trick so um then you now resize it so the next cool thing you can do here is just to um make a relative position if you want to center it automatically click on relative position in here relative position and then click to center this arrow here with um, a center um two arrows pointing to the center is center so click on that it will center it automatically relatively to your canvas so to accept that change click on the um, good sign there so the next one to center this one click on relative center center your amazon relative size center is already centered click good so one more thing to add here is a text so add a text you add one more text to um so that's the name of the um the book writer so I'll add a text here drag it over here it will be at the bottom so click on edit so the um my user should be spark mike spark mike okay that's my um, pen name i don't normally use it always so you can put anything you want here so click okay so here we're going to just drag it over here and then um, apply a color to it 
let's see we want the font size to increase spark mic okay like click on okay put a color of white to make it stand out from the background good and then we want a font size we want a, a font style click on font style choose this amaranth bold to apply that and then we have amaranth bold here so once you have your design finished and um, all finished out all you have just do is export it so click on the three dots at the um, upper right hand corner so once you click on it you go to um, export image to export it to any format of your choice so as you can see we have a um, format of jpeg jpg so i kind of like this jpg because um, it's the standard for um, amazon kindle publishing so once you have that don't mess around with all these things you can also make a quick share which i'm not going to do i have to just save it to my gallery so save to gallery it renders your image and saves it to your gallery so once that is um, saved you can now go to your gallery let's see here is my gallery gallery then click on that once you have that you can locate pixel design it will automatically save it to a folder named pixel design so if you don't have a folder named pixel design it will save it there so i'll click on that to open it so as you can see this is the full um, design so thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you in the next video